Iran will respond with fire and fury to US and Israel. Iran has promised to seek vengeance upon the perpetrator of deadly blasts that have reportedly killed more than 100 people at a ceremony marking the fourth anniversary of the death of a famed Islamic Revolutionary Guard Quds Force Commander Major General Qasem Soleimani in a US airstrike. The fear of the Zionist regime and its puppet terrorist groups of martyrs Soleimani led to another crime in Kerman during this commemoration ceremony, the Iranian mission to the United Nations said in a statement shared with Newsweek. Iran will respond with fire and fury to the orchestrators, perpetrators and anyone who's aided and abetted in this terrorist attack, the mission added. The comments marked the closest Iranian officials have come to directly blaming Israel for the attack at a time when tensions between the two nations have been flaring over the ongoing war in Gaza. Local emergency services have said that at least 103 people were killed and 211 injured when two explosions occurred in quick succession near the Saheb al-Zaman mosque in Kerman. The semi-official Tasnim news agency cited sources saying the blast emanated from two remote control detonated bombs hidden in bags, though this information has yet to be verified by any official accounts. Washington says USA and Israel had no role in a terrorist attack in Kerman, Iran. Really? A fox smells its own lair first. The Iranian president's political deputy Mohammed Jamshidi wrote on X. Make no mistake, the responsibility for this crime lies with the US and Zionist regimes and terrorism is just a tool. He added, the United States had earlier rejected any suggestions that it or ally Israel were involved while Israel declined to comment.